Japan just cut the yen. They cut their currency so low that I couldn't buy the cats. He's always bought, he always, he's bought Caterpillar tractors. Now he's buying Komatsu. Yeah. And I say, what the hell are you doing? He said, look, I owe it to my wife, I owe it to my family, I owe it to everybody. I owe it to my company, to my employees, I gotta do what's right. So he bought Komatsu tractors instead of Caterpillar tractors. This is happening more and more. You know, China, in ordering Boeings, took a lot of the secrets. They said, look, we're not going to buy your planes unless you give us your secrets. So stuff that they have years and years of, of engineering and knowledge, they give it over to China. China is now building commercial airline divisions where they're going to make their own airliners. It's going to be brutal. They're, doing, they're killing us, folks. And we can't let it, we just get, we have a president that doesn't have a clue. He doesn't have a clue as to what's going on. We're not going to have jobs in this country. You know, GDP, so last, last quarter, we were negative. You don't see that. You see China announced 7% up, and that's like the worst thing that's happened to them in 10 years. They're, seven, they're up 7 points, and they're doing badly. We went down. So in other words, we're getting smaller, and yet we have more people. And we have people pouring in. And when I said Mexico is sending, these guys with all those cameras, they didn't write it. You know, when I said, I'm pretty good at what I do. I went to the best school. I know what I'm doing. I said, Mexico is sending. They cut that out. They cut it out. You know, sort of interesting. I have an expression that and we have lots of expressions in this group that I can tell you, right? But I have an expression. The American dream is dead, but I'm gonna make it bigger and better and stronger before. No, no, it's an expression, and I say it a lot. The American dream is dead, but I'm gonna make it bigger and better and stronger than ever before. I say it all the time. So I go home. My wife says, oh, darling, that was terrible. I said, what did I do wrong? Oh, the expression you used on television. I said, why? Everybody loved it. I got standing ovations. It was an unbelievable speech. What's wrong? She said, you said, the American dream is dead. I said, no, I didn't. I said, ba, ba, ba. She said, so I turned it on, and here I am. The American dream is dead. Cut. And I said, oh, that's terrible. These people right here, actually some of them. So, we're going to have a very, very successful time. New Hampshire is so important. I spent a lot of time in Iowa. Those people too, they are just phenomenal people. They work so hard and they are so discouraged when they look at what's happening. You know, you look at, again, Japan where they send millions of cars. We send farm products. Very little, relatively speaking. 